A few years ago, I bought this dress for $15. Bargain. <laughs> I was going out to dinner with some friends, thought my friends had seen all my other dresses. I'm going to need something new. And naturally, I went and picked up something new. Before I continue, I'd like to ask you all to consider what you're wearing today, or where it's from, and if you remember what was on the tag. Because little did I know that there were seven sneaky facts about the dress that I just bought. This dress is made of cotton and polyester. To grow enough cotton to create this dress, you need 10,000 litres of water. That's a small swimming pool. To bleach and dye this dress, toxins run off into Chinese ecosystems, killing wildlife. The design process of this dress created waste. This waste is called offcuts and usually it's treated as rubbish and sent straight to landfill. This dress was made in China, in a sweatshop. It was most likely made by someone who worked 16 hours a day with less than minimum pay. Last year there was a factory collapse in Bangladesh, which killed a thousand people because their health and safety standards weren't up to scratch. The distribution of this dress, the carbon footprint I should say, is huge. Often a dress will start in Europe, it will then source material from India, it will then fly to, to China to be manufactured, it will then often come back to Europe to have handmade or more finer details added to it. And then it's shipped around the world for retail. Collectively, Australians purchase one billion items of clothing per year. There's 22 million of us, which makes it nearly an item per week. Do we really need that many clothes? Did I need to buy this particular dress? The company I bought this dress from doesn't have a recycling scheme. Unfortunately, 5% of our landfill is made up of unwanted clothing and textiles. My name is Etta. I am the director of Undress Runways, a sustainable fashion show here in Brisbane and now Melbourne. I discovered sustainable fashion four years ago when I saw local designers were doing great things with very little support. We curate sustainable day wear, evening wear, lingerie and swimwear from around the world. We bring these clothes together to one location on one night once a year. Think organic fibres, garments dyed with turmeric and red wine, zero waste collections, ethically produced garments, bamboo underwear and much more. At Undress Brisbane, we started off by taking it off and we began to think more sustainably about the way we create our clothes and shop. If you don't know where it was made, where it came from, or where it'll, en it'll end up, take it off. What I'm wearing now is what we call sustainable fashion. It is made from bamboo, which only requires rainwater to, to grow. <laughs> it is treated with a low water dyeing process, and the wastewater is recycled to preserve our ecosystems. It is made of offcuts. These three sections are actually offcuts from another collection. And the offcuts of the offcuts are then used in the rest of the collection. It is made in Australia, in a place that has healthy working conditions with fair pay. It came from Melbourne. They're offcuts from a designer in Melbourne, and it was made here in Brisbane. So the carbon footprint is much lower. The use phase. I always wash this on cold and use non-toxic laundry detergent to conserve water and the environment. I actually borrowed this dress from a friend, so I'll be returning it to her later today. 
Borrowing clothes is actually a very sustainable way to pick your next outfit. I'm passionate about changing the fashion industry, about providing sustainable clothing options and supporting designers who are doing the right thing. Everything you're wearing today has a story with contributors. And change comes from people like you, the everyday consumers of clothing. And together, we can change the fashion industry. Sustainable fashion is like turning the lights off when you leave a room. It's like turning the tap off when you're brushing your teeth. And it's like using canvas bags when you go shopping. It's an easy choice we can all make. Next time you go shopping, have a look at the tag and think about where this piece of clothing came from. My Australian dream is to create a world where we, the consumers of fashion, use our dollar to vote for a sustainable fashion industry. An industry where we treat our fellow human beings as worthy individuals and take care of our earth because we've only got one. So remember, you've always got the option to take it off. <laughs>